Hello everyone and welcome to Vlogmas day three. And this time it really is day three. It is about five o'clock and I am on my way home. Hopefully traffic isn't that bad because I do have to stop on my way at Michael's because today is, dun dun dun, dun try it Tuesday. So every Tuesday of Vlogmas, we are going to try something new. For some Tuesdays, it is going to be a new planner of 2020 to show you what's up and coming. It might be a craft or a gift idea. But today, what I really, really wanted to do is I have seen these jar snow globes that I think are so cute. So we are going to try to make them. However, I do need to swing by Michael's on my way home to pick up liquid glycerin. Um, they do have it at Michael's, oddly enough, but you're supposed to pick it up in pharmacies and all of those places. So maybe this isn't going to be the right stuff, but we're going to give it a whirl. We're gonna see what happens. Some Try It Tuesdays might be really successful. Others, maybe not so much. But I thought it was just a fun thing to do and an awesome way to learn some new crafts or some ideas um, and to share those with you. So today, we are doing snow globes and we will see how those shake out. On today's Advent of Kindness, we were to give out as many hugs as possible and I'm a hugger. So I actually, the last thing I did before I left work was give someone a hug. Um, so I definitely hugged a lot of people today. The other thing that I am really excited is if you remember on Monday, the advent calendar was around uh, doing something with a loved one that they really love and not complaining or anything. And as you know, Steven and I were away from each other on Thanksgiving, so I didn't get to do that one. And I was like, how could I make it up to him? So I've actually planned a little weekend getaway for us, and I rented us a big, beautiful log home in the mountains, and that's totally something Steven would love and he enjoys the mountains and the outdoors, whereas I'm more of a city person. So I thought that is something he would enjoy. So we're gonna do a little Friday to Sunday weekend getaway in December, and we're gonna go into a log house in the woods um, for him to help make up for missing the first day of the advent calendar. I am so excited with how excited you are for Vlogmas and how you're also saying like, this actually is like part of my holiday tradition now. This is what gets me in the spirit. The fact that these little videos that I make mean something to you is just the coolest thing. And I actually was watching Christina Brawley, who I love. Um, we actually just messaged each other on YouTube because she was like, we would be such good friends um, in real life because we're friends in like the YouTube Instagram world. But I really do believe that her and I would get along very well. But I thought she said it best in her day three video, which I'll leave linked down below. She said, it is such an honor to be invited into someone's home. And that's what you do. You invite us into your homes. Um, you share your most precious gift of your time with us. And I think for anyone who doesn't realize what a great privilege and honor that is, doesn't deserve to have the platform because it really, really is, at the end of the day, truly about the connection between me and you. And the fact that my videos can um, supply you with an escape, uplift you, make you feel really good or positive, that is truly the only reason I do this. It is for connection and to make 
a different footprint in this world. And every time you walk away from my video, yes, you might try a new product that you really like, a recipe um, that your family might enjoy. You might even get a new decorating or tip or trick or hack that you're going to implement that will make your life a little easier, your home more festive. But in all honesty, what I hope and wish for the most is that at the end of each video, you feel a little bit lighter, a little bit brighter, a little bit more uplifted, a little happier, and that's really all that I want. And the fact that this Vlogmas thing, these 25 straight days happen every year, there's just something super special about it. And I know that you guys feel that it's very special and a part of your holiday season, but for me, it is a huge part of mine. And I think I get as much joy out of creating it as you do from watching it. And in fact, I probably would say I probably get more joy out of creating it, even though some days it's really, really tiring. But we are going to get to Michael's, get Vlogmas officially rocking and rolling, and then, yeah, that's the plan, Stan. I'll see you shortly. walked in the door and I'm just gonna say some of you judged me yesterday for opening my advent calendar the wine one with my coat still on and guess what I'm living my best life and I'm going to do it again so let's open the wine because let's face it it's the most important part day three wait did Steven Wait. Christopher, I hope you don't mind me helping you out with this advent calendar. I saw days one and two and liked this one the best. Then I found this one was a Pinot Grigio, my favorite white wine. I'll think of you later when I'm drinking it. Love, Gail. <laughs> um, my mother-in-law was here to pick up Bubba's and she totally swiped my wine. That's a good one. That is a good one. Gail, I hope that you are loving that wine. I'm gonna consider it an act of kindness because there's no one I'd rather share my wine with than you. Love you. Don't worry, my friends, because I still have wine. We'll be all right. What is this? Oh, I actually bought this with my mom and I know I really liked it. So I actually picked this up at a little wine tasting room that my mom and I went um, to when we were Black Friday shopping. Some of you asked about these glasses. They are from Crate and Barrel. I believe they are currently on sale. So I will leave them linked below if you're interested in them before Steven sees this. This is the house I rented us, and I'm gonna, this is how I'm gonna surprise him. So these are some of the pictures of the house that I rented us for a weekend. And it's so, so pretty. I cannot wait to go. It'll be a nice little weekend to get away. Yes, no, we came up with that. Uh, we came up with that. Uh, Did you at least film the unboxing? No, but she has a picture. Okay. So, um, yes. She did not want to do it. And I said, I opened it up and I said, oh, it's a white wine. It's Pinot Grigio. She's like, I love Pinot Grigio. I was like, Christopher does not like Pinot Grigio. So I gave it to her and she wrote that nice note. Okay, so all I've done is taken the lids off and made sure to get the stickers off of these jar bottoms. And now what I'm gonna do is take a piece of sandpaper and just kind of rough up the inside of the lid, really just to help things perhaps adhere a little bit better. And this is why Try It Tuesday could end up being a disaster. All right, so 
the reindeer is too big. All the things are too big. All right, we're gonna fix this though. We can totally fix it. For this one, I think I just wanna do like a single solitaire, like cute sisal tree. I just wanna keep it really, oh, that's what I need. I just wanna keep it really easy. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna put a little bit of this glue right on the bottom of this. And I'm gonna do my best to center it in the middle of the jar. And we're just going to let this set and cure so that when it's in the jar, it's right in the center and it looks really, really cute. Learned a few lessons about Try It Tuesday. The first is think through all the logistics first because read the back of the glue and it has to cure for 24 hours before coming in contact with water. But we'll finish this tomorrow, but I wanna show you what I'm thinking. I'm keeping them pretty simple. I think I'm going to try to stack another bulb on top of this one once this one settles. And I kind of just want this little one to just have the tree in by itself. What you do then, which we'll do tomorrow, once these are fully cured and dry, you will put water, some glycerin, which helps suspend the glitter, and then you add your glitter, and this is like a pretty good size. You don't want the extra fine because it'll be too little. You also have to make sure you use distilled water because the minerals in the other water will be cloudy and the distilled will be really clear. Try it Tuesday. We're making snow globes, but it's actually not gonna take place until Wednesday. I'm also using my wallet to prop up this ornament. The Body Shop, day three. Day three. Three. It is a juicy pear shower gel. I also just found that there is a fact about a famous woman on each box. So Emmeline Pankhurst founded the Women's Social and Political Union in 1903 to campaign for women's right to vote, becoming a leader of the British suffragette movement. So cool. Gosh, I love this advent calendar even more now. Let's go ahead and do... Paper Chase, day three. Oh, day three is right here. It is a cat pen. I have so many friends who will love this. And I'll use it as a gift topper for someone. Sing it with me. Pour some sugar on me. Number three. <gasps> These are truly one of my favorites. They are the watermelon slices. They are so, 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 so good. I love them. I'm actually going to really, really enjoy those tonight. Let's knock out Kiki K. Day three. Day three is right here. It is this really cute navy and rose gold notepad. Day three. What pin do we get? I really love this pin. It's like a pale blue anchor on like a coppery rose gold. All right, for our nativity scene, day three is Oh, these are really cute. I love how modern they look. It's a little sheep. We'll put him right here by the tree. Lastly, we have our diptyque to open. Day three is right there. So we will go ahead and pull that out. It's a, another fragrance, Tamdale. All right, I have some pictures to show you of a house I found. Are we buying this house? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> what do you think? Uh, it's nice, it's very nice. It's way more your style. It is, I like the uh, the wooden beams and everything. Ooh, a big TV for you, yes. Well, if I would be in the country, I would need a large TV. Of course you would, yes. And then these are the kitchen. Ooh, I guess I love it. There's another one. Ooh, a balcony for Bubba's to prance around. Yes. Because he likes to prance and uh... And then... <gasps> what is this? I booked it for a long weekend. When? From December 13th to the 15th. 
Oh. It'd be like a little getaway because I missed day one of the advent calendar. It was supposed to do something with your loved one that they like without complaining. Mm -hmm. And I, you are definitely more of the mountain rustic one. And I knew this is something that you would enjoy. Can we go skiing? Yes. <gasps> if it's snowy, I will try. Of course it's going to be snowy. Okay, yes. We're going skiing on the 13th to the 15th. Well, I'll ski one day. I'll shop the others. We'll ski. Yes. <laughs> I'll well, shop. I'll, I'll film. It's, it's fun. Downhill All right. skiing is fun. So we are. Aw, thank you, babe. You're welcome. Um, it'll be like one of your Christmas gifts. All right, it's Michael's tea time. Oh, Michael's this, tea time. this advent calendar always creates some sort of. Drama. Yeah. Last year it was Boxgate. This year it's Michael's tea. All right. Great. Okay. Did you uh, have the tea yesterday? No, I edited it and then fell asleep. Oh, oh um, no, no coupon. It's a breakfast blend, no, no coupon, no. Coupon, coupon? Coupon. I wanna know, do you say coupon or do you say coupon? Coupon. Coupon, coupon. I say coupon. I wanna know down below, vote one or two. One if you say coupon, two if you say coupon. There's no Q in coupon. Coupon, it's like luncheon meat. Do you call it lunch meat or luncheon meat? Luncheon meat. It's lunch meat. It's luncheon meat. You know what? Go get a coupon for your luncheon meat. <laughs> That's just like elementary school or grammar school. It's elementary school. It's grammar school. You're ridiculous. All right, what is the breakfast blend? Um, black tea. So this is high in caffeine, David's breakfast blend. Michael's. <laughs> David. You actually looked to make sure. It says, because I have my glasses on, it says high caffeine. Oh, he just wants to prove that he can yes, read. I can read with these glasses. We can't do 24 dog days of <gasps> Christmas. I forgot to give those to. Uh, because Bubby is in here. So when Bubby does come back, he will have a bunch to open. All right, my friends, I'm going to really keep Vlogmas that quick and that short today. Um, just because Try It Tuesday is going to take a little bit longer, but we'll definitely do the snow globes tomorrow as well as wrap it up Wednesday. I have a really cool idea for wrapping gifts. And remember, tomorrow's Vlogmas will come even later because I have an event after work. And then Thursdays will be even later because I have Celine Dion, but there will be a video for every single day. Um, but some days are just going to be a little bit more low-key. So I'm going to end this one like I end all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, bye-bye.